Yes. More. Right, now I'm just gonna go ahead and make this huge pencil weapon. Might take some time. Yeah, you, you know what? I think I'm pretty happy with that. Welcome back to Hard Bullet. Some new updates have come out, so now we can do this. There's a spawn tool right here. Look at this. We can have access to all the weapons, the props, enemies, and, well, all of this stuff right here, which I'll probably use a little bit later. I mean, look, we can even just spawn in a table if we want, and then spawn in a crowbar to destroy it. <laughs> And for some reason, we can get a couch. <laughs> Look at that. Here, why don't you take a seat right there? That's it. Sit down. Now, this is also new. We have a spike wall right here, which I'm looking forward to using a little bit later. Now, another thing that we have is the cleaner. So we can go ahead and clean up the mess we've made. There we go. We've got some shotguns over here. You know what? In fact, <clears throat> let me use it. <gasps> Ah! So yeah, it's quite cool that we can actually spawn this guy in. So I'm pretty sure he was in like the main spawn area when you joined the game. And now we can just go ahead and spawn him whenever we like, which is pretty awesome. But anyway, let's head over to the welding table because I realized something. I haven't really created a custom gun before. I've created custom weapons that were pretty awesome to use on the ragdolls. But now let's choose a gun and then just customize it a bunch. Now I could just use the new spawning system, but I'd rather just go over to this right Right here. Oh, there's some guns missing. I guess I need to unlock them, maybe. You know what? Give me this. Now, all we need to do is uh, get some weapons from here. I think I have made a custom weapon before. Maybe we should add a shield, actually. I'm pretty sure this worked fairly well last time. Okay, so if I just put it here and then this can be like our cover. I don't know. It might help just a little bit. There we go. So when people try to shoot me, the lid should help out just a little bit. Yes. Nice. So now we need to choose some maybe melee weapons to go on the front. Aha! What about a giant spear? Now, this could potentially make it a little bit more difficult for me to aim, but I think it's going to be worth adding. So here we go. Attach it to the gun. Looking good. <clears throat> Clear my throat. Now, I quite like the look of this weapon right here. So I'm going to take it and, um, well, where am I going to put this? Um, hmm... Where would look good? Uh, all right, you know what? This might be a little crazy, but what if I have two of these sticking out from the shield? Uh, you know what? <laughs> sure, I'm going with it anyway. I say we just go ahead and give this a go. So let's turn this off. And now let's see if we can actually hold it without it going all crazy. Because remember, this thing is going to weigh a lot more now that we have all these weapons on it. I can barely even grab the gun. All right, there we go. My custom weapon is ready. We might make some adjustments in the moment, but for now, let's just go ahead and test it out. All right, here we go. Uh-oh, enemies are here. Okay, and engage! Fire! That's one down so far. There we go. Yes, it's working pretty well, but of course, we need to see what it's like with- Oh! That was weird with the weapons on the top. Oh, okay. Right, charge! Yeah! It didn't work. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, there we go. We got it. Uh, ah, use the shield. Is the shield working? It is. <laughs> Look at that. Wow, who would have thought that a lid of a bin would be so useful? Right, quick reload. And now let's move in. Let's go. Let's take him out using the spear. Yeah. Oh, I got him in the hand. It can be a little bit awkward to use sometimes. Oh, I got him. Ah, we caught one. <laughs> Get off! <laughs> there we go. Okay, what about the uh, the swords we have? Do they work? It's kind of awkward to use them, though. Yeah. All right, let's be honest. The design of this weapon might not be my best. Oh, there we go. We got him. And fire! Yep, this really throws your aim off when you have a spear at the end. It's too heavy. Eh, still works. Sways all over the place, though. Ah! <laughs> How am I supposed to use this? Right, maybe if, I don't know, grab one of the weapons. <laughs> ah, this could work. Charge! Oh, <laughs> got him. Right, you want to fight? <clears throat> right, slow motion action. Disarm. Give me that gun. Give it. That's it. Oh, oh he whipped out his sidearm. Spear in the heart. Die. Get off my weapon. Whoa. What's happening? <laughs> I'm flying. Okay, you know what? We got a good little spot right here. So one, I just go ahead, grab my gun, do a quick reload, and then open fire at the enemy. Ah, yes. There we go. I've got all of them now. Yeah. So you know what? Overall, not a terrible weapon, but I think we can definitely do better than this. Now, 
What if, hear me out, we use a pistol here and then grab a pencil. And this is going to be a very, very simple design. Let's turn on the zero G. And then all we do is this. Wow. This is like the ultimate John Wick weapon right here. So simple, but perfect. All right, get ready for some John Wick action. Here we go. Take this guy out. Urgh. Oh, how is he surviving this? Okay, there we go. Quick reload. Excuse me, buddy. How are they surviving being shot in the face like that? Right. Time to use the pencil. Oh. Fire. Is he dead? Oh, wait. I just realized. I think the pencil might be getting in the way of the shots, potentially. Oh, but this guy's so screwed. Oh. Well, that's a bit awkward. Got him. John Wick gun, John Wick gun, come to me. Got it. Oh, hang on a minute. This guy wants to fight. Okay, let me just put my weapon down for a second. Put it on this side. Oh, forget it. Come on, then. Let's go. Wanna fight? Oh, oh wait. <laughs> okay, never mind. His buddy shot him. Right, time for some serious John Wick action. <sighs> shot in the head. Give me that. <laughs> Disarm. Uh, keep shooting. Give me that. Also, don't forget, these are just ragdolls. They don't have any feelings, okay? I've got your buddy. What are you going to do now? I've got a hostage. If you shoot me, you shoot him. Oh, well, I, I, I guess they don't really care. There's also a guy behind me. Excuse me, sir. Do you mind not shooting at me? That would be great. Stab. Stabby, stab, stab. So honestly, this is a great weapon, but I think we need to make a few adjustments real quick. Stay down. Now, what are those adjustments I hear you ask? Well, I think we need some more pencils. So you know what? Actually, let me go ahead, get the spawn menu, and uh, let's see. We need more pencils. Yes. More. Right, now... I'm just gonna go ahead and make this huge pencil weapon. Might take some time. Yeah, you, you know what? I think I'm pretty happy with that. This is what I love about the hard build updates. They just get really weird and you can start doing some really strange stuff and get creative. So uh, yeah, let's see if this actually works, shall we? Um, it's a little bit heavy. Ugh, who would have thought all these pencils would be so heavy? Oh, I can barely lift it. Look, it's breaking my arm. Oh my goodness, my arm. That is actually terrifying. Okay. Oh, ah! <laughs> no, what have I done? Ah! <laughs> Every single time I play hard build, I break it. Uh, okay, let go, let go. Ah! <laughs> what have I done? Whoa! I've created the ultimate weapon. All right, you know what? Let's spawn in some enemies and see if it kills them. Go, go, go. Oh, <laughs> this is insane. Okay, is it going to work? Okay, just, just take cover. Stay down. Oh, the enemies are actually spawning in, but I think they're just getting messed up straight away. Like this guy, ready? Wait for it. Oh, is he going to die? Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> this is so weird. Oh, yes, they're all dying, though. I don't have to do anything. I have accidentally created the most powerful weapon in the game. And who would have thought it'd be pencils combined and welded together? This is so good. Look, he's down and dead. The guy over there is gone. And that guy, <laughs> they just disappear. Oh, okay, but it also hurts me too. <laughs> ah, oh, dude, take cover. Everybody run for your lives. Run. <laughs> okay, I'm going to hide in the corner. That's it. Whoa, whoa. Ah, you really can't hide anywhere from the pencils. Whoa. Oh, man, I'm really breaking the game here. Okay, you know what? <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and restart the world because clearly this is very, very broken. Anyway, let's try out... Oh, whoops. The new spike wall. Okay, uh, uh, why is it being weird? Stop being weird. Okay, there we go. Oh, and place. Place another one, I don't know, over here maybe. And there. And now I need to remove the ones I actually placed. Oh, whoops. All right. Over to the enemy generator. All right. Hey, buddy. You are going to be my first victim on the spike wall in the name of science. Let's go. Whee! All right, let's see if we can pin you to this wall. And huh, is it working? Yay, the spike wall works, which is pretty cool. So that's pretty nice design. And he's okay. He loves it. He's having a great time. Maybe I'm just going to scale him down a little bit. Maybe that'll be a little bit better. All right, buddy. This way. And you, my friend, are going on this one. There we go. Yay. That's actually really cool. Okay. Shh. Shh. I'll take you off. Don't worry. I'll save you. Only to throw you back on. Oh, I actually worked. <laughs> All right, let's get another one. Yay. <laughs> right, what do we want? Uh, maybe a giant this time. Let's go for... Oh, how, how tall do we want to make them? Uh, 3.5. Holy. 
Forgot how large they are. Alright, we're gonna have to break his kneecap in order to get him down here. Come on, dude. Need you to fall over, please. You absolute unit. Come on. There we go. Whoa! Ah! Watch it, man. Jeez. Okay, well, he's a little on the heavy side. I grab him by the ear. This way, my friend. To the spike wall. He's too heavy. He weighs like five tons. Be with you guys in a minute. Hang in there. You know what? Actually, we need a new spike wall. Why don't I just bring the spike wall to us? I, uh, um, hello? I think I broke it. Anyway, I guess let's just try that again. Here's the spike wall. Maybe his foot can go on it. This won't hurt a bit. You know, this is a terrible idea. I, I literally can't even lift this guy over. You're safe, okay? Because I just I just can't take you over there, all right? You're too much of a unit, all right? <laughs> this is really weird. But anyway, on that note, I'm going to end this one right here. There's another video on the top right. So make sure you go ahead and check that out. Also, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll hopefully see you in that video right there. Goodbye! Bye.